PD 8x12 filler and uh, what we're doing is we're going to go over uh, the custom CIP system uh, at the customer's request. Uh, as you can see the nozzles are set up with umbilicals and uh, there is multiple modes in here for cleaning and flushing a machine just like any well behaved machine should have but what we're going to do is we're going to run this custom application. Uh, this is clean, going to clean mode password protected. It's a custom clean. This screen has operators that let you fill through this product valve, fill, fill the tank through the spray bowl and drain the tank. Multiple modes for, uh, for other cleaning options and also float status. The blinking lights show that both floats are down. Uh, tank's virtually empty. Okay, and this unit, again, you've got, your, this shows your, your pump for spray ball, your, your uh, spray ball valve, the product pump and product valve, status of all those operators. We're going to park the nozzles because we've got tubes on them for draining into a tank. Uh, we've got a clean time, we're setting a clean time on it, just, you don't have to because the thing's not actually running under float control. Uh, we're going to set a pump speed of 300 RPM at this point. Uh, this has got a, this is the start button and we're going to press the start and what you hear now is the uh, process tank is uh, being filled by the product pump. The protocol they gave us has a uh, main feed as you can see the product pump and product valve are on and they're to remain on for 45 seconds. Okay, at, four, at, at 45 seconds the main drain just opened and the spray ball valve is on. And what we're doing, you can see the tank is draining, and we're going to do that for 30 seconds. Now at the end of 30 seconds, the, the, uh, the spray ball valves will shut off, but the drain will stay on for five more seconds. Finishing draining. Now the next protocol to switch to is it's filling the tank for the product pump, product valve is showing on, and it's going to fill until we make the top float. Now my assistant Will has got our two, two level ball float, and what Will's going to do is go ahead and he's, he, he's just made the top float, and what it's doing now is running the pumps. So we emulated the tank was full because we don't have a lot of drainage. Now next he's going to, em to emulate the low. He just dropped the low ball shut the pumps off and as you can see all the operators are done everything's finished tank is empty we also have a uh, final drain valve so the operator at the end of this it says drain tank at end of cycle the operator can completely drain the tank